Jimmy G. <laughs> he says, I know Judson is in shambles because of Jimmy G string, but you got to get it together this morning, man. <laughs> and he quoted you. He said, that was on me. <laughs> get it together, man. I'm handling it pretty well. You're all, you're all right. The Jimmy Garoppolo thing. You're fine. Were you yeah. expecting any victories from San Fran? Well, this oh, was you did the, predict him to win, didn't you? This Over year Kansas was the City. ground floor. I did have a bull and prediction. Arrowhead. Wrong again, yeah. Richards. It wasn't necessarily that. Bad. That was more than just a loss. Whoa. Ooh, yeah. Marco, you want to talk about being sensitive about this and being in shambles? Mark Willard, super sensitive about Jimmy G getting out. I mean, in the game, he's like, I heartfelt condolences to the city of San Francisco, the <laughs> Giants organization. <laughs> <laughs> This is football, dude. People, getting out. It's being a getting out. Get, get out, out of bounds. The, people get hurt all the time. What are you doing, Jimmy G? I love this. Justin Houston, Kansas City, outside linebacker. He said Jimmy G's injury was his fault. Be smart and step out of bounds. Like yes. trying to give a dude advice from another team. He's like, what are you doing? Seriously. Run out of bounds. Everybody trailing on the player is like, oh, he's going to go out of bounds. He didn't go out of bounds. What are you doing? You're going to give yourself a concussion. Going to hurt a shoulder. You're going to break a collarbone. Oh, you're going to tear an ACL. The biggest problem go, I have with that hit is, is, and by the way, he, he welcomed contact. Now I thought that he was knocked out of the game because of a helmet to helmet, but it was him trying to get another yard. But the problem with that extra yard in itself is there was going to be a player waiting to hit him on the other end. Why would you ever welcome contact from a professional contactor, a hitman? <laughs> go out of bounds. Oh, Jimmy, Jimmy. Jimmy, bad plan. Here's some, here's some sound from the injury. Shotgun snack for Garoppolo. Oh, Jimmy stepping up, avoiding a rusher, spinning out to his left. Can he make something happen? Looking toward the end zone, not going to run sideline. Garoppolo to the 10. Garoppolo takes a hit, and he's down at the 8. And he's hurt. At the 7. And Garoppolo is a little slow getting up. And I give Jimmy a lot of credit and for now, trying to stay back inside, Ted, but he's got to go out of bounds right there. He, he cannot take that hit. Thank well, you can't you. give him credit and then take the credit away. <laughs> for, try, for trying to stay inside there, but you got to go out of bounds. There's no credit should be given. It's like, Jimmy, grow a brain, go out of bounds. Choose safety. Choose to fight another yeah. play. Your team only goes as far as you're going to go. And uh, that defense is Well, brutal. there's the competitive spirit thing, and then there's stupidity. It just makes no sense. It doesn't, It, right? it makes no sense. Maybe the greatest was LaDainian Tomlinson. LaDainian Tomlinson never had one surgery over his entire NFL career yeah. as a running back. Well, right? you have to make, and we called these, and my coach, offensive line coach at the time, Hudson Houck, would call them as LT would step out of bounds before welcoming contact. He would go, that's a business decision right there. Yes. And he praised LT making business decisions. And then the next running back that came in was Ryan Matthews. Ryan Matthews, welcome contact. And I praised him for loving the physicality of the game. But it was reckless. And I remember at one point he popped his calf in San Francisco trying to fight back into contact and pick up an additional three yards after you had already worked 35 yards down the field. Live to fight another day. Stiff armor dude. Get out of bounds. Save your legs. Save the injury. Jimmy G, this was cavalier. It was just reckless silliness. You know, one of the problems for 49ers fans is, keep in mind, Jimmy had only started seven games or eight games, whatever it was to begin this season. Yep. So although the 49ers were not going to compete and they were not chasing uh and may not even be chasing they a playoff chasing spot, the playoffs. No. But they and they certainly weren't chasing the Super Bowl. But the problem is you would like Garoppolo to grow as the team is growing. So sure. next year when he comes back in, he's still going to be a very very young quarterback making Fresh. young decisions. Like the stupid decision he just made yesterday that cost him the season, although still yeah. waiting for official word. Time on the job would have been good for right. Jimmy G, but time out is also going to benefit San Francisco. They're going to get a better draft pick because Jimmy G's not in there to get them a couple of victories that they're not going to get with C.J. Beathard, most likely this weekend starting with the Los Angeles Chargers.